I was, um, I was pleasantly surprised at the number of entries that we had. I think we had over 80 entries and the variety and the ingenuity that people had put into the entries was, was excellent. So I was really delighted that we got such a positive response. I didn't want to make the decision myself on what would be the winner, so we brought together um, a group of volunteers from the lab. So I think we had probably about 12 people volunteered to review all of the ideas. We went through them one by one. What we were looking for was something that was very creative something that within a two-month period of the internship at, uh, at the lab here in Oxford that somebody could really do a prototype and put something, something real on the table so that they'd, uh, they'd developed uh, in, in the lab what they'd, uh, they'd thought of. But also we were looking for something that would really be a benefit to society. Jobsic is an interactive touchscreen chopping board that simplifies healthy cooking in, in the kitchen. Uh, Chopsic has many different features. The scales function is an embedded scales that will eventually be underneath the top and glass of the actual screen, but at the moment is um, the strain gauge is underneath the whole screen and it will come up on the graphics here with a zero function and that just weighs the ingredients that you use within a recipe. When you put a recipe into the recipe builder and then you say that you only want to cook for three people, it will automatically scale up or down the recipe that you've put in it. So say if you had um, an old recipe that was cooking for five people, you'd put all the ingredients in and the amount it serves and that will scale it up and down depending on how, how many people you want to cook for next week, maybe three. What we really liked about the, the chopstick idea from Siobhan um, is that we all know that there's a, a challenge in the world from obesity and that people are eating too much food. So this was a brilliant idea. It was actually quite a simple concept. Everybody in their kitchen has a chopping board. Um, people have online recipes or they have recipe books. This brought it all together, but the health dimension was something that really attracted us, that you could look at your, your proportion sizes, link that to the, the number of people you were cooking for, and, and do that in a system with a, a, an interface which actually is very close to Sharp's business in, in LCDs. Shopstick itself will have an embedded um, Wi-Fi system, which will have a browser in it, so that it will remember the recipes that you have used over, over the week. Um, with the recipe links page that it has, you can just add all of those onto your shopping list so that you know that next week you can make that recipe with the recipe already on the board. For those who don't want to use it all the time and actually you only want to make a salad which you don't need a recipe for, you can just use the board as a normal chopping board. Um, it will reduce the amount of sensitivity that you have on the board and it will just have a plain background of either wood or I'm hoping to put a, a settings feature in it which you can personalise your own chopping board to make it integrate with the, the surroundings of your kitchen. My name is Ed Hayward Lonsdale and I'm an engineer here at Sharp Labs and I've been helping Siobhan out with her chopping board which she's been doing for the last two months. All along the way she's been really great at taking initiative. She's asked other people around the labs for some ideas and she's taken it much higher than we were expecting. Uh, to get a fully functioning prototype in just six weeks now has been a phenomenal achievement and we're all really impressed with how far she's gone and how well integrated everything is, all the different uh, scales and screen, and the wooden chopping board and the glass. The project's kind of taken over my life so much that I go home at, and I work on the interface so I work on reports or I'll go home at the weekend back to Essex, my family home and I'll go through all my ideas with my parents. I did the user um, feedback with my brother chopping on the board or I'll run my ideas past my dad, who's a mechanical uh, product design engineer. Well, she has a real heart for design. She's really thought through all the different uh, pages and screens, and we're all really impressed um, with how great it actually looks. That's not something we're very used to here as, as researchers, so it's been, been great to see that happen. Mm -hmm.